let's say that we are in September and we have elections in Egypt. And let's presume that the Muslim Brotherhood uh, gained and win the majority places in the parliament. What will be your position? Will you accept uh, the idea that the military regime in uh, Egypt have to prevent the Muslim Brotherhood of taking uh, the, the power in Egypt, like it happened in uh, Algeria? Or we have to play the democratic game and uh, let uh, the Muslim Brotherhood uh, win Egypt like the Hamas did in Gaza? I had a stand in Algeria in 1992. I was favorable to the interruption of the, of the, of the process. Uh, the, the FIS and the GIA coming into power seem to be opposite to democracy. I had the same feeling uh, in Gaza. For me, it was a coup. It was a coup, a democratic coup, but a coup. Hitler in 33 was a coup, a democratic coup, but a coup. If Muslim brothers uh, arrive in Egypt, I will not say democracy wants it, so let uh, democracy uh, process, of course not. Democracy, again, is not only elections, it is values. Barack Obama after uh, Montesquieu. So you have to have the truth. But my belief now, if you want my bet, and I take a risk saying that, my bet is that Again, I'm not an expert on Egypt, but as all of you, I try to look, to look at what happened there. My bet is that the new atmosphere prevailing in Egypt will not be a good, such a good wind for the Muslim brothers. I, I don't buy the theory which is expressed here and there that the Muslim brothers are the only organized force that they are the only one uh, able to take advantage of the situation. To understand, you're saying that if they were to win a legitimate election, you would urge the military not to allow them to take power? I will urge any, I will urge the prevention of them coming to power, but all by also. <laughs>